Alright, reach across the body for me. Take it overhead. Bring those heels up. Open that chest. Our knee lift, pull it down. Good. Open up those hips, touch the inside of that foot. And your arms are just doing those jumping jack arms.
So your opposite arm is reaching overhead and your leg crosses the other one. We got four, three, two, knee to opposite elbow.
Last four, three, two, and one. Catch your breath. Come back with some weights for overhead press. Grab a sip of water. We're going to squat and press. You're going to keep your weights here at your shoulders the whole time. You're going to squat and press. Good. Make sure that when you're pressing, your glutes are tight. Abs are tight. Make sure in that squat you're sitting back. Feeling those glutes squeeze or stretch. Good. Last four, three. Last one right here. Set those weights down. We're going to come back to it. You're going to give me a big step, a big jump or a calf raise, and then you have four, three, two, one. Here we go. Take it over. Big jump. Four, three, two, one. If you're not doing cross country, you can do a knee lift. Make that step really big. Good. Make sure you're using those arms in that cross country. Even if you're just walking your cross country, use big arms. Woo, that's it. Last four. Three. Two and one. Back to our squat press. Good. Keep up, keep up. Last four, three, two, finish that last one. All right, here we go. Big step, big jump. Four, three, two, one.
So we've got 10 more second pushes. And then we're gonna add a curtsy in. Four, three, two. You're gonna give me a curtsy. Right foot goes behind. Stand up. Give me a raise. Down and lift. If the arms are getting tired, or you can always bend those elbows. Ten seconds left. Three, two, one. Put those weights down. We're gonna punch, punch, punch. Let's see what it was. One, two, three, four. All right, so it's across the end. Three, two, one, cross. Now, you're welcome to have light weights. You want a little bit extra. You're also welcome to shuffle using more space. Keep those back 
nice and long. Give you one more. We're going to add in our upper row. Remember, you're zipping up the body. Elbows lift. Weights come to the armpits. Beautiful work. That's it. At the top, your head's lifted all the way to the ceiling. Glutes are tight.
your back is nice and long. Think about shoulder blades are down your back as your starting position. And then they squeeze together. Thank you. 
Bring us into a 10 seconds. Four, three, two, and one. Set those weights down next to you. Bring the legs to tabletop. Your hands are coming up behind the head. You're going to give me bicycle crunches. Thank you. 
Last four, three, two, and release 
all the way down in your child's pose. And then you're going to come up to a down dog. Down dog. And I want you to see if you can push those heels towards the floor and your hips to the ceiling. Get a good stretch of those calves and the back of the legs. And I want you to come into a forward fold. So either walk the feet or hands together so that you can just dangle here. Let your head relax. In this forward fold, I want you to take your right hand to your uh, opposite foot and give yourself a little twist. So you can drop that shoulder down. And then you're going to switch left hand to the right foot. Give yourself a little twist. Get back to center, soften those knees and roll yourself all the way up. We're going to come into a lunge. I want you to get nice and big right here, kind of like if you're doing your warrior. And then that back foot's going to turn so it faces forward with the other foot. You're going to reach up and you're going to drop those hips down. Bring the hands to the waist. Come to center. We're going to hold here. Toes are facing forward. Just give me a forward fold. Soften those knees and roll yourself up. Then we're going to turn to the other side. So turn both feet. Reach up and drop those hips. See if you can get those fingertips to reach all the way to the ceiling. Good. Hands to the hips. Bring it back to center. You're going to give me a side stretch. I want you to turn your right foot out and then take it all the way down. Walk your fingertips all the way down to the ankle. Maybe you can get to the floor. Walk yourself back up. Turn that toe, turn the other toe out, about 45 degrees, and walk yourself down. Think about pushing those hips up to the ceiling, letting your chest rest towards your thigh. And walk yourself back up. Bring those feet together. Clasp those hands behind. Open up the shoulders, stretch the arms. Then you can take your right arm across your body, hug it in tight, and drop that right shoulder down. And then take this right arm behind the head, up on the back. And we'll switch to the other arm, take it across the body, pull it in snug, drop that shoulder down. And take it behind is our tricep stretch. Good. Release those arms. I want you to open up your shoulder blades. Reach those hands in front. You can drop your head down. Take a couple breaths in that open space in your upper back. Feel it expand. Good, arms come up to the ceiling, inhale, exhale, give me some shoulder rolls. And I want you to give me one big inhale, it's Monday, exhale, all right. Well done you guys, thanks for working out with me.